When I think about my future, you know what I'm saying, I see big, you know what I'm saying, I see huge, you know what I'm saying, I, I see bright lights, big stages. Yo, 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 mic check, one, two, one, two, mic check, one, two. So I had a connect at a university and, uh, you know, he always kept me in mind when it came to music and he called me up, he said, hey man, I got an opportunity for you to open up for Future, do you want to do it? I said, hell yeah, like Future, like hell yeah, I want to open up for Future, you know what I'm saying? So I was excited. You know, I called up my homeboys right away. Hey, we hitting the road, let's go. They was with it. What we do? Shut down show? Who are we? Nah, we finna wreck this bitch. Turn up. I was born to win, so I refuse to ever lose. Got a heart full of passion and a whole lot to prove. I just struggled, I didn't hustled, I didn't paid all of my dues. Through adversity, I fight now. Take a walk through my life. Take a walk through my life. I was always taught to dream big, and that's exactly what I do, you know what I'm saying? I dream big, you know what I mean? So yeah, I was ready, you know what I'm saying? Because actually, Future at that point in time, too, y'all got to remember, he was hot in 2013, you know what I'm saying? Like, I mean, he's still hot, but back then, that's when he was first hitting the scene, so he had that new song, you know what I'm saying, Bugatti with Ace Hood. He was, I woke up in a new Bugatti. Hey, I woke up in a new Bugatti. Then he had that song uh, that play in the clubs. Y'all know what I'm talking about. I'd be like, nigga, you ain't about shit. Nigga, you ain't so shit. Like, that That was crazy to me. So I was like, hell yeah, I was hyped. The funny thing is, I don't even tell nobody this, but I listen to like future songs like that whole week. Like, you know what I'm saying? Just knowing I'm about to open up for him. But I was ready though, you know what I'm saying? I was ready, I was focused, you know what I'm saying? Cause I knew I was opening up for future, so I was like, I gotta bring it. I mean, we had to hop on the road, of course, to shoot to Oklahoma, like out of the middle of nowhere. Finally got to the venue. The stage was legit. I mean, it was a real nice setup stage. The lights was crazy bright. It was like surreal to me. I almost forgot Future was supposed to perform. I thought that shit was for me. Like, that's how I was looking at it. I'm like, hell yeah. This is what life is about to be like, you know what I'm saying? Look, I come from a place that I like to call Neverland, but not the place for me to pin on me, become a better man. If you got a chance to fly, don't never land in Neverland. Better known as Hydro Clean, Texas Neverland. I find I got you, then I know you, I don't know you. Don't ever talk to this, but on this mic, I'm going big, boy. Hit them haters talking about me, hey, because they like it, boy. Play the game like the game, boy. Did a sound check, and then what topped me off is like never had any show I've ever done. They never gave me no dressing. It's crazy, you know what I'm saying? I got a dressing room, like this shit is crazy. I only had like one outfit, but I needed one. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? We walk in our dressing room. It looked like a sports storage, but they like you could just tell they move shit aside to give us room to change in there. But it didn't like it was so crazy. We didn't even care. Like we was just like fuck it. We got a dressing room, you know what I'm saying? And it fade out like right there. That's how you need to be coming out. Like after that pro, that pro thing. Now I'm gonna come out, like I'm gonna let it ride for a little bit and then right before he say propane back, I'm gonna be on, I'm gonna come on stage. So the University of Langston is the HBC, you know what I'm saying? Historically black college. So the crowd is predominantly black. When the crowd is predominantly black, you know what I'm saying? They're the hardest crowds because you have to prove more to them. Nice, those take those up. I toss it. No, don't do that one. I'm just saying. <laughs> just give it your idea, like have a freestyle. So I'm nervous, you know. And it's funny because I'm, like I say, I'm normally excited to do shows, I'm ready to do shows, but I was dreading the time they would call my name. Like I was like, oh shit, like, don't call me next. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, so it was crazy. And I was backstage waiting. I knew going into this crowd, I had to prove something. Cause they gotta imagine, they waiting on future. You know what I'm saying? So they like, who is this coming out? You know what I'm saying? So they ain't even know me. So I had to go out there and prove something. Langston University, Langston University. First of all, we'd like to thank you for bringing us over this, these highways safely. Thank God. Uh, Lord, we ask you, Lord, to just Lord, help us, Lord, to focus in on this show. Uh, we'll give you all the praise, Lord, and all the glory. In Jesus' name. Amen. 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 This voice came in the back of my head and said, man, you do this a thousand times.
Don't do nothing no, no more different than you do every time you hit that stage. You be you, you get out there and you kill it. You show these people what real music is. So once I felt that, I was like, fuck it, I'm out. Not only did I perform, but I got the chance to see a future concert too. So it was cool, man. Looking back, I thought this was gonna be the show, you know what I'm saying? This is my future we talking about, and I was opening up for who? Future. So I'm like, I'm opening up for future, this is my future, so I'm thinking, damn, I made it, baby. You know what I'm saying? I thought I was gonna be able to call moms and be like, mom, we made it. You know what I'm saying? Tell all my niggas we made it. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> but as fast as he was out that door, when that show was over, so was that show. You know what I'm saying? That show was done. It was back to the grind, you feel me?